So, uh, you got a slow hard drive, huh? Is it slow like a turtle? Don't worry, I'm gonna show you how to make it fast as <laughs> boy! <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, the first step is just unplug your hard drive right now and replace it with an SSD. Yeah, really. Just throw away your hard drive and tell me who uses it nowadays, huh? So I do, but uh, you know what? No, never mind. Okay, uh, enough time wasted, uh, let's start the video. And yeah, drop a like. Uh, let's start from the basic, okay? Uh, first of all, go to my PC or this PC. And you see my C drive is an SSD. So we will optimize the D drive only and not gonna touch the SSD. Because since D is my hard drive. Show me a hard drive and tell me who uses it nowadays, huh? So uh, what you're gonna do is right click your hard drive and click properties. Then you will see disk cleanup. Just hit disk cleanup. Select these boxes and then you have to click clean up system files obviously. And the size of the clutter and cache is little in my PC right now because I recorded a video for this disk optimization yesterday but deleted it for some reason. So uh, yeah, all the clutter is mostly removed already but it won't be the same in your case. So yeah, you follow the steps, okay? So the size will be a lot bigger. Once it is done, just hit OK and OK. Just go to Windows and search bar and type uh, percent temp percent. These are all the useless and temporary files that are created when you do something. So these are not really required afterwards. So just control A and shift delete to delete all of these and leave the files that can't be deleted. Now uh, hit windows R and type pre patch. Hit continue and do the same control A shift delete and skip the files that can't be deleted. Oh, uh, hit windows R again this time type just temp select all uh, wait a second select all shift delete skip the files that can't be deleted now what you can do is just go to the search bar again and type defrag this window will open up or what you can do is this PC right click properties and go to tools and you will see optimize here so basically it's the same thing. Now this is the D drive as you can see hard disk drive that, that is HDD. So just hit analyze and hit optimize. It can take quite a bit, you know, depends on your PC. But I won't recommend you waiting for it to complete because it can take very 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 long at times. So after pass 1 is complete or maybe if you want to wait for pass 2, your choice. Once it is done, you can just go ahead and close it. Okay, so uh, this step about the startup and background apps is for those who do not have uh, SSD, obviously. As you can see, my operating system is in my C drive, so not really a problem. But if you have just a hard drive and it has your operating system, what you can do is go to task manager go to startup and disable all these useless apps you know library wallpaper using it so no these are all required so as you can see rain meter is not required by default it was enabled so just click on the app and hit disable steam i disabled it obviously not required and so this is the way you have to do it if you have utorrent and stuff that is enabled just go ahead and disable all those because it affects your startup time on the PC you know it takes a lot of time to boot if all these apps are also running in the background when your PC starts now go to the search bar and type background apps and you can close all these because these run in the background and eat up a lot of memory and make your PC slow so go ahead and just disable all of them
Okay, now uh, go to this PC, right click, hit properties. On the right hand side, advanced system settings. Under performance, it is settings, just click settings. And here, in the visual effects, just click adjust for best performance. Hit OK, and your desktop might look a bit different afterwards. Hit OK, and that's it. Now, uh, yes, one more thing. Okay, I forgot to show you. Go to properties, advanced system settings, and advanced and you see virtual memory here right it is automatically manage paging file size for all drives you can just uncheck this one and select no paging file this will make your PC a bit faster and because this paging file thing eats up us a bit of space in your hard drive so yeah obviously it no paging file okay apply and okay it will prompt you to restart so you have to restart afterwards so the other thing obviously most of the things i have showed you but what you else you can do is if you have a bit of clutter in your hard drive you can obviously go ahead and delete those if you don't need some apps or files that are eating up space in your hard drive then it's better to remove them if you have some games that you don't really play just remove them if you have a lot of videos or photos that are useless right now you can go ahead and remove them as well because the fuller the disk the slower it is and the last thing is obviously if you have money to switch to an SSD that's the best option otherwise uh, the steps I showed you are enough to make your PC a bit faster than it used to be uh, I hope this video helps and if it does make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel because I already told you only three percent of you are subscribed so yeah make sure to subscribe and join my discord and follow me on Instagram as well thank you